Yo, what's going on, Sexy Sound Squad? Today we're here doing a ranked 1v1. I'm going to be playing Oleron to just show off that he is probably, if not definitely, the best Mage ADC in the game right now. He got buffed along with the Hecate Ring. Um, <clears throat> he got buffed, sorry, along with the Hecate Ring... I guess change or like implementation or whatever you want to call it really, but he got changed and it's kind of nuts. He's a little bit, he's a little bit on the strong side. We got to stop meeting like this. <laughs> uh, yeah, we do. <laughs> Let's get him the nem on the real though. So chat, I, a lot of people, Donovan with the, the Punisher is actually a friend of mine named Donovan and when I was saying how annoying it is and how lame it is that he was playing like that um, in the other game, I, th I believe it was yesterday's Sun Wukong game. I don't know, I recorded it a few days ago, honestly, but... Um, when I made that video, I... It's not an insult to him as a player saying how lame or, like, unfun he's playing. It's the insult to the god, you know, like, the... It's literally the same thing as the saying, um, well, I guess it's not really the same thing. It's quite the opposite of hate the player, or don't hate the player, hate the game. Whereas I just, you know, I hate the matchup, which is like the character. I don't hate him. He's a great guy. He still comes to my stream and hangs out every day. He's awesome. I love Donovan. What I don't like is the fact that he had to play that game like he did, you know, in order to win. And he messaged me yesterday um, saying that he was getting hate messages because of the way he played that game. And I got to say, honestly, if you guys are part of my community and you're sending hate messages, uh, fuck off. I don't want you in my community. Like, uh, my community is supposed to be all about spreading love and positivity in pretty much a game where there is none. And yes, I know sometimes the tilt gets to me, um, but it does with everyone, you know? Tilt tilt slams everyone once in a while. I don't like... Hmm. I really would have enjoyed... Him not being uh, alive after my ult there, but. Bomaruski, dude. I'm just back here. I overstayed my welcome slightly. I'm not gonna die for it or anything, but. That was slightly risky to do. Alright, he got his golden blade. To put a lot of the respect on it. If he ults me now, I'm pretty scared because I might die. He does a good amount of damage with that Golden Blade, and I did get Hecate Ring, which, you know, is like the most overpowered item in the game. So, that's how I'm deciding to start here. Oh, my, my one didn't go off, dude. If my one went off, I actually killed him there. If my one went off, I actually killed him there. See, what killed me? It was just the autos, man. The autos shred me. This two actually fucked me up really hard, too. Alright, that really sucks. I need to get the late game. Because, you know, I'm Oleron, so... That's how that works. How do I get to late game? I'm a little scared because like... Nemesis isn't necessarily a pushover late game. Kill me here. Why do I feel like he can? Mm, 
I'm a little bit terrified. Come on, dude. Alright, I'm gonna back. A little bit scared. I'm lying. I'm really scared, actually. I do actually think that uh, that Oleron is really OP, though, right now. With the Hecate Ring change. It just is unfortunate that I don't play him enough to really show off, I guess, how super OP he is. I wish I did play him more, honestly. Alright. Oh, lame. I'm actually just gonna back. So I am gonna go lifesteal build, by the way. I mean, that's pretty obvious, because... Oleron's an auto-attack mage, and on every auto-attack mage you build lifesteal. I hope he doesn't go... Okay, he's not going Pestilence or Toxic Blade here. I dislike that, but I mean, that's definitely how you beat Oleron, is you just stop his clear. Wow, that was unlucky. I really needed that not to crit, to be honest. Alright. You know what? That is not bad. Pretty good tower damage, boys. Pretty good tower damage. And the whole wave is cleared, too. Got a boy. In our defense already, I think I'm going to go into Demonic. Because I need some pen. I do need some pen. I wonder if he actually went straight to Bull Demon. That would have been smart if he did. Fuck, he did. I He has enough damage to do it before I get there, I think. Shit. Did he ult me there? I want to see he did, but if he didn't, then I lose this fight, and that's kind of scary to me. Get a kill, yes! Oh baby, we did it, okay. I really thought I was gonna choke that kill, dude. I really thought I was gonna choke that shit. That would have been so bad if I did. Um, I think I go sprint for sure here. Cause, well, I mean sprint's OP. All right. This is a good match, by the way. He has higher MMR than me, and I'm fucking number six in the world right now, so... The fact that he has higher MMR is kind of crazy. He is a really good player, though. I mean, I've said it a bunch of times. He's fucking good as shit. I didn't stop his back, did I? Ooh, this is up. 
What up, gamer? Oh shit. Ah oh, shit. Him having defense and me not having any uh, really fucked me up there. I lose tower here, I think, because I won't be able to get there in time. I want a breastplate. I'm going to go breastplate and chronos pendant because I, I want as much cooldown as possible. Can he get tower here? He has a lot of attack speed. I'm sure he can. He doesn't really do a lot of damage, but his attack speed is so high. I mean, yeah, it's, it's 2.0 already. Well, I guess not. He doesn't really do that much damage in general. Well. Alright, alright. I think because he doesn't have beads, if he dashes on me and I ult him, he loses the fight. Him not getting beads was a big misplay, in my opinion. Not that my opinion matters, I guess. How much is uh, breastplate? Twelve fifty. All right. Well, I definitely won that fight. Damn, once he gets his Toxic Blade online, that's going to be annoying. Holy shit, I was so silent that whole fight, dude. That was such a close fight, bro. Holy fuck. That was so well played by both parties. Oh my god. What a fucking game, dude. Holy fuck that fight. Such a hard matchup for Nem. Yeah, I'm sure it is. Damn, I can't even get Phoenix off that. Oh, please get the please get the minion. No, I need that minion. I needed to kill that minion so that he couldn't push me, man. If I killed that minion, I had him. Oh, did it get it? Oh, my my wave got him. Oh no, my wave didn't get him. Fuck, minion, you suck. Look at that one HP. Removes backdoor protections now. I can just take it. Damn, bro. That's so crazy how uh, how one HP on a minion can change an entire game. And I'm not saying I lose off of it, obviously, because that'd be absurd, but losing a tower off of one HP on a minion is kind of nuts when you think about it. I got Breastplate. Um, I think I'm going to go for the cooldown play here, actually. I went from no cooldown to 30% in like 0.5 seconds, so that should help quite a bit. And if I fight in my minion wave, especially with my alt up, I also have upgraded relics, so that should help a lot. Well, I have upgraded. I have the important upgraded relic, I should say. played honestly i'll take that that was his alt and his thorns right
Okay. We're doing good, I mean... Well, I guess relatively good. I'm doing as much damage as I humanly possibly fucking can, dude. Whatever, I got his wave. I'll take it. I got his wave and I re-got his phoenix. There's no way he can push my phoenix down. That's really good for me. I spent so much time just beating the living fuck out of that that uh, that Titan. That I mean, once I get Telekines ring, I should be be able to just smack it down, right? Everything is broken. Yeah, man. It actually replaces Bancroft's. That's how broken it is. Um. By the way, most people um that are playing right now, they actually don't build. Bancrofts. They just straight up build Decade Ring because it's so strong and it gives life skill as well. So you just go like instead of going Bancroft's cooldown boots, you just go Decade Ring into uh, life skill boots, and the the curve is still really strong. I have alt again, so I'm willing to uh, you know willing to tussle a little bit. Alright. That was his thorns and I believe his ult as well. Which I will 100% take once again. And it's going to be kind of the same deal, right? Like... Oh, GG, bro. What a close game. Can't outplay that. I mean, I don't think you outplayed me in general, but um, I agree, it is a tough matchup. I actually want to see after after beating him. I want to see what rank I got in the world. I was rank six when I went to sleep last night. I guess I haven't checked. I could be like rank thirty by now. But how much MMR did we get off that game? Am I at twenty five hundred yet? Hey, twenty nine? Nope. I'm at twenty four eighty. So what does that put me at? One, two, oh, hold on, let me, Master, Grandmaster, reload this bitch, you feel me? Any day now. Dude, all seven of my losses, I'm 30 and seven right now, all seven of my losses are so bogus. This is rank 14, but it's one, two, three, four, five, six, I guess, rank six. I mean, I went to bed at 6, and I'm still ranked 6, so I guess I'll take it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, peace.